You say there, there was that better than expected debt auction over in Italy on Wednesday. Investors essentially sending the euro to its lowest level in more than 10 years against the yen. Uh, a new 11-month low against the US dollar as well. And of course, you've got the low volumes brought on by many traders and investors still being on holiday. That's amplifying a, a lot of the moves in the markets. Uh, as you mentioned there on Wednesday, we saw the Italian Treasury auctioning some $12 billion of six-month Treasury bills. That initially supported the euro in the quiet markets. But of course, it started to fall uh, as soon as yields on Italy's 10-year bonds neared 7%. That's the psychological mark that had previously forced countries like Portugal and Ireland to look to international assistance. Now, investors are now looking, of course, as you mentioned there, to the 10-year bond auction that will take place today. Uh, many analysts, in fact, saying longer-term debt in the Eurozone is much harder to sell right now. Uh, investors also being somewhat spooked by the European Central Bank, uh, which had data showing Eurozone banks deposited a, a record five. $185 billion with the central bank. They say that's worrying because it's a sign that banks may be hoarding cash and are still fairly distrustful about uh, lending it to each other. Thanks very much, Sharon. Well, let's get further.